Hello and welcome to this episode of the English Idioms series. Today, we're going to look at the idiom to get to the bottom of things. First, we'll look at the meaning. Then we'll focus on how to pronounce this idiom fluently. And finally, we'll have an example sentence. Here's a definition from the Cambridge Dictionary, which states that to get to the bottom of things means to discover the truth about a situation. So we could rephrase that by saying if we get to the bottom of things, we find out what's really going on or what really happened. Focusing on pronunciation then, with that first line, we can potentially have two weak forms of the word to, which is t, and we can kind of link get and to because there's two occurrences of the t. So that would sound like this, to get to. We can also have a weak the before the b and a weak of. So running all of that back together, repeat after me to get to the bottom of things. An example to finish then. Money keeps going missing at work. My boss has asked me to get to the bottom of things. Over to you then. Have a go and make up an example sentence trying to use this idiom within an interesting context. And if you leave that in the comments below, I can give you some feedback about your grammar. I hope you found that useful. If you did, go ahead and hit like to support the channel. And if you want to work with more idioms, then check out the playlist. If you haven't already, then remember to subscribe so that you don't miss out on new videos. Thanks for watching and have a lovely day.